Hello mga math enthusiasts! Welcome back sa ating YouTube channel kung saan ang math ay mas pinadadali at mas minamahal. At andito na naman si Teacher Maria, ang inyong math buddy para tulungan kayo sa mga problema nyo sa math. And for today sa video, ang pag-uusapan naman natin ay tungkol pa rin kay polynomial equation. Pero i-guide ko naman kayo sa learning task number 3 ng inyong mga module. Mga anak, sana nakakatulong si Teacher Maria, ha? Nakakatulong ba? Huwag kalimutan i-comment yan sa ating comment section. At dahil ito na ang last ng ating uh, activity sa ating first quarter, gusto ko lang sabihin sa inyo na masaya ako na nakasama nyo akong muli sa journey ninyo para para matapos itong quarter na ito at excited ako na makasama muli kayo sa ating second quarter. Sana loyal love ma TV kayo mga anak ko at masaya ako dahil nga sa dumadami na kayong nagugustuhan ang mat. Okay? Please comment sa ating comment section ang mga nararamdaman ninyo ngayong tapos ninyo or tapos nyo na ang inyong mga module. Okay? For number one, find the roots of 3x plus 1, x plus 2, and x minus 2 equals 0. So, ito, very sisiw lang, mga anak ko. So, you just have to equate all into 0 para makuha yung roots. So, this will become... Okay. 3. Ay, sorry. Sumobra sa tinta. Ay, yun ang nangyari. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. So, we have there... 3x plus 1 equals 0. Ito naman ay x plus 2 equals 0. And then yung isa, x minus 2 equals 0. So, transpose to 3x is equal to 1 divided by 3. Para x lang siya. So, x equals 1 over 3. Yung isa naman ay transpose lang x equals 2 positive magiging negative 2. Ito naman, transpose lang din, x is equal to negative 2 magiging positive 2. So, therefore, the roots are 1 third negative 2 and 2. So, ganun lang siya. Now, for this one, find the zeros of the polynomial equation. Medyo matrabaho to mga anak ko ha. O, sige, let's identify yung PQ. O, anong mga factors ni 24? Kasi yun yung itatry natin later on. So, 1... Factor niya si 2, factor niya si 3, factor niya si 4, factor niya si 6, si 8, si 12, at si 24. At lahat yan ay may positive negative. Okay, teka, sulat ko lang ha. Positive negative, and then positive negative, and then positive negative, positive negative. Dahil yung Q naman ay 1 lang, so nandito naman si 1, okay na yan. Okay, so let's try. Paano kung... 1. Itry natin si 1, ha? So, P of X is equal to X raised to 4 plus 2 X raised to 3 minus 13 X squared minus 14 X plus 24. Itry ko nga si P of 1. So, tignan natin kung magsi 0. Pag nag 0, ibig sabihin factor siya, ha? So, we have here... Uh, what's this? So, we have 1 raised to 4 plus 2 times 1 raised to 3 minus 13. 1 raised to 2 minus 14 times... So <coughs> Sorry, plus 24. So, this is 1 plus 1 raised to 3 is 1 times 2 is 2. Minus 1 squared is 1 times 13 is 13. Minus 14 plus 24. Okay, 1 plus 2 is 3, minus 13, minus 14, plus 24. Okay, so this will become 3 minus 13, that's negative 10, minus 14, plus 24. Negative 10 minus 14 is negative 24, plus 24, equals 0. So, ibig sabihin, okay, mga anak ko, ibig sabihin, si 1 factor siya. O, di ba pag nalaman na natin, let's go to synthetic division para malaman natin yung susunod na equation. So, you will have here, oh, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Kompleto naman. So, 1, 2, negative 13, negative 14, and then 24. Okay, so let's have 1, 1 times 1 is 1, 2 plus 1 is 3, 3 times 1 is 3, negative 13, Plus 3 is negative 10. Negative 10 times 1 is 
negative 10. Negative 14 plus negative 10 is positive 24. Positive 24 minus uh, times 1 is... Ah, negative 24 times 1 is negative 24. 24 plus negative 24 is 0. So, yung susunod natin equation ay... Ay, ano, uh, dito naman tayo magda-try, okay? So, okay na si 1. Okay, feeling ko si negative 1, hindi niya rin, hindi siya magzi-zero, ha? Kasi nung tinitingnan ko pa lang yung number, feeling ko hindi. Pero itain nyo, ha? Itry nung subukan si negative 1, pero ako hindi ko na susubukan. Gusto kong subukan si negative 2, okay? So, kung si negative 2 to... Ito na yung bago nating uh, gagamitin, ha? 1, 3, negative 10, negative 24. Okay, so this is 1. 1 times negative 2, that's negative 2. 3 plus negative 2, that's 1. 1 times negative 2 is negative 2. Negative 10 plus negative 2 is negative 12. Negative 12 times 2, positive 24. See, ang galing ko mang hula. So, negative 24 plus 24, 0. Okay. So, ibig sabihin, eto, pwede na kasi natin i-factor. Pag tatlo na lang, pwede nang i-factor, ha? So, eto ay magiging x squared plus x minus 12. O, so, anong factor nito? Anong factor ni 12 na kapag pinag-minus mo, 1 ang answer? 4 times 3. Very good. Okay. So, 4 and then 3. Dahil negative to, ibig sabihin magkaiba ng sign. So, dahil positive ang middle term natin, yung malaking number, siya yung positive. Ito yung negative. O, equate lang natin sa 0. So, x plus 4 equals to 0. So, x is equal to negative 4. And then, x minus 3 equals 0. So, x equals 3. So, iyan, saka iyan. Tapos, meron kang 1 dito, saka negative 2. So, ano bang question? <coughs> Find the zeros. Find the zeros. So, therefore, the zeros are negative 4, 3, 1, and negative 2. Yun na. Okay, next for number 3, find the polynomial equation whose zeros are 3 of multiplicity 2, negative 1, and 2. Okay, so tandaan ninyo, ito bagong maging 3, that's x minus 3, ha? Kaya siya naging positive kasi nilipat siya. Dahil naka-multiplicity of 2 yan, squared mo siya. And then, tong negative 1, bago naging negative 1 yan, galing yan kay x plus 1. Itong si positive 2, bago siya maging positive 2, galing siya kay negative 2. Okay, and then we try to multiply. O, x minus 3 times x minus 3 times x plus 1 times x minus 2. So, this one is x squared. Uh, negative 3x plus negative 3x is negative 6x. Negative 3 times negative 3 is positive 9. And then we have... <coughs> Sige, times na rin natin to. x squared, uh, x plus negative 2, so that's negative x, and then 1 times 2 is negative 2. Okay, saka natin i-multiply ito. Okay, so 1 by 1 tayo. Ito muna, x squared times x squared, x raised to 4. x squared times negative x, negative x raised to 3. x squared times negative 2, negative 2, x squared. Okay, next, negative 6x times x squared, that's negative 6x cubed. And then, negative 6x times x, that's positive 6x squared. And then, negative 6x times negative 2, that's positive 12x. Okay, sana hindi nalilito si Teacher Maria ha. Baka kasi lumalabo na yung mata. Okay, tas ito naman i-multiply natin. 9 times x squared. That's positive 9 x squared. Dapat, dapat, dapat na ha. Para mamaya pag nag-add kayo. And then 9 times negative x is negative 9 x. And then 9 times negative 2, that's negative 18. Okay, and then we add. Bring down x raised to 4. Negative x cubed plus negative 6 x cubed. That's <coughs> negative 7 x raised to 3. Okay, ito muna. 9 plus 6 is 15. Plus negative 2, so 13. So, positive 13 x squared. 
Okay, 12 plus, uh, positive 12 plus negative 9. So, minus mo sila. So, positive 3x minus 18. Okay, so yan na yung sagot natin. O, galingan nyo dyan sa inyo, ha? Linawan ng mata. Okay, for number 3, ilan pa ba to? O, last na to. For number 3, find the equation if the zeros are 3, negative 1, 3, negative 2. Okay, so pagsamahin ko na to, ha? Kasi pareho naman sila. So, x plus 3 x plus 3, x minus 1, x minus 2. Pero pwede namang uh, x plus, ay, sorry, sorry. Mali, mali, mali si teacher Maria. Mali, mali, mali. Next side. Dapat yung kabaliktaran nila, ha? Kasi zeros to. So, bago siya naging positive 3, x minus 3 muna siya. Okay? Tapos ito, bago maging positive 3, x minus 3 din muna siya. And then ito, bago maging negative 1, x plus 1 siya originally. And then ito, bago maging negative 2, x plus 2 muna siya. O, ito muna isasolve ko ha. x squared, negative 3x, tapos negative 3x pag inad, positive 6x. Negative 3 times negative 3, that's positive 9. Ito din naman, so we have x squared, tapos 1, uh, x plus 2x, that's 3x. Ano na to ha? Shortcut na to ha? Kasi 1 times x is x. x times 2 is 2x. So, x plus 2x, so 3x yan. Okay, plus uh, 1 times 2 is 2. And then, pwede na tayo mag-distribute. x squared times x squared, x raised to 4. x squared times 3x, that's positive 3, x raised to 3. x squared times 2, that's positive 2, x squared. 6x times x squared, that's 6x raised to 3. Katapat na nung 3 ha. 6x times 3, uh, 6x times 3x, that's positive 18x squared. And then, 6x times 2, that's... Uh, ay, sorry, sorry mga anak. Ito pala, buti napansin ko, ito ay negative ha. Kasi negative 3x, tapos negative 3x, negative 6x. So, pag ito, negative 6x times x squared, negative 6x cubed dapat yan. Tapos negative 6x times 3x, that's negative 18x. Okay, teka, teka. Wait, 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 wait. Ayan. Okay, and then, negative 6x times 2 is negative 12x. And then, yung 9 na, 9 times x squared, you have 9x squared. Positive, ha? And then, 9 times 3x, that's positive 27x. And then, 9 times 2, that's positive 18. And then, we add, kasha pa ba? Okay, kasha. So, x raised to 4, positive 3 plus negative 6. So, that's negative 3x cubed. Hindi pwedeng i-add, ha? And then, 2 plus negative 18, that's negative 16 plus 9. That's positive, ulit, uh, negative 16 plus 9. Okay? 2 my, plus negative 8 is negative 16 plus 9. So, hindi sila pwedeng i-add, kaya magiging 7 to, no? 7, negative 7x squared. Tama ba? <coughs> Tama. And then, plus, hindi rin pwedeng i-add ito. 15 na lang to. Negative 12 plus 27, 7 minus 4. Okay, x, and then plus 18. And then, that is the answer. Ayan, mga anak ko, sana natulungan ko kayo dito sa part ng inyong mga muzul. At sana natulungan ko kayo ngayong first quarter. Yung mga sentence na lang naman ang sasagutan, katulad ng susunod dito sa letter B. Mga anak ko, kayang-kaya nyo na yan, ha? I-analyze lang at masasagutan ninyo. At dahil dyan, sobrang saya ko dahil natapos na natin ang first quarter. Magkita kita ulit tayo sa ating second quarter. And please, don't leave me. Dito lang kayo sa ating YouTube channel. At lagi ko kayong i-guide, ha? At dahil dyan, please follow me. Tapos na ang first quarter. Baka hanggang ngayon ay hindi pa kayo nakafollow sa ating Facebook page. Please do follow this one. Love Ma TV. Sige na mga anak ko. At syempre, laging tandaan, let's spread the love of Ma. Thank you and... Bye.